hear him? I don't know if it can. What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing today? Welcome back. I'm Sean. And I'm Jen. And, and that's T'Challa. Hello, T'Challa. You can't see him, but he's here. He's there in spirit. I'm not just petting the floor. <laughs> She's petting the floor. No. <laughs> today, we are back to talk about some updates on... The wedding! Yes, ah. we are here to update you on everything that we've sucked at uh, regarding the wedding. <laughs> <laughs> no, like seriously, we are, according to all wedding groups and all wedding like planning stuff, we are so behind, like ridiculously behind, but there's a level of not care that we both have that's kind of going to be problematic about a month before. I know I'm a type A but I don't know if y'all saw my TikTok lately when I listed the 10 jobs that I have. Mm-hmm. Wedding planning is not one of them. So this type A don't have time mm-hmm. for that. And the <laughs> thing is, is that we, there's a lot of the stuff that, that would go into a normal wedding that's not going into ours. Yeah. So it's, and there's a lot of extra stuff that's going into ours that doesn't go into a normal yeah, one. Yeah. So the, the timeline of events is a little, a little skewed, a little strange, but we have made some progress on some mm-hmm. things. Um, uh, if you're kind of new and you thought we were getting married last fall, we didn't. And then, uh, we moved the wedding to summer, this coming summer. So our wedding's in like four months, wait, April, May, June, July. Yes. Our wedding is in four months. Four months and (sighs) nine days. Something like that. Yeah. So I'm not panicking. You're panicking. This is the face of me panicking. (laughs) Yeah. So it's, it's, uh. We're getting there. We're Mm -hmm. getting there. And we have some things that we have been doing and then some things that we still haven't done because we suck. (laughs) Um, But we have a list of things that we wanted to tell you, like Mm -hmm. some updates. So So the first thing is decided on the cake. Originally, his mom was going to make our wedding cake, but Mm -hmm. she's now flying in the night before the wedding, so she can't make the wedding cake. And that's Mm -hmm. okay. Like, I just wanted to know, like, do we have to order a cake? Is she still going to make it? Like, what's Mm -hmm. happening? Um... And just the timeline of things isn't working out. So I'm like, okay, let's look at some options. We are so excited about what we picked. Um, uh, For those of you that are not, like, in in our close friend circle and don't know, we live in Florida, okay? So um, there's a thing about Florida that you have to be Floridian to really understand. Gators. No. Oh. (laughs) It's Publix. Mm -hmm. They have the best cake ever. They also have the best subs ever mm. even like even as a vegan we can eat them now oh yeah they have, yeah, the, they have uh, vegan, vegan pub subs yeah um if you ever hear somebody from florida mention a pub sub and you have the opportunity to have one do it mm-hmm. they also have the best chocolate chip cookies i've ever had and i've had chocolate chip cookies pretty much all over the u.s and europe at this point point. Mm. and they have the best cake i've ever had and i'm a big lover of cake and i have had lots of different cakes so trust me i know what i'm talking about mm-hmm. i have cake cred <laughs> and Publix is where it's at. So we are taking this opportunity to not only save money on a cake, because when you go to a small bakery or when you go to like one of those like bakeries that specialize in wedding cakes, um, you get you get beautiful looking cake, mm-hmm. but you're you're lacking what Publix has, and I don't know what it is. Maybe maybe it's I I don't know. It's magic. It's fairy dust. I don't know. (laughs) They just put something in the cake that makes it taste good. It's the most moist cake I've ever had. The frosting's perfect. It's just just so good. Um, So they're also not that expensive. They don't have as many options as far as the cakes. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not super customizable. But we did end up finding something that we really liked. Mm -hmm. Something that's very us. Oh, yeah. I don't want to, like, give it away. But But there's going to be options for different people. Yeah, because not everybody likes cake, right? Mm -hmm. So this cake includes three different types of desserts all in this cake. Cake is one of them, because I love cake. (laughs) Yeah. Cake is amazing. Um, So we're excited that we got that done. So that's a big... (laughs) Door dashing cake. Yeah, Um, right. No, so uh, we got that done. That's a big thing for people. We didn't exactly get that done because on this list that we have right here, it's things that we've done that we want to tell you about. And then I added things we haven't done yet that we probably should do. And one of those things is order the dang cake. Oh, yeah. We haven't done that yet. We have to actually (laughs) go and order it. We picked it online, but like we have to go and order it, Mm -hmm. you know? But at least we know what we want. So We're pretty sure we know what we want. If they can customize it a little bit for us, we definitely know what we want. It's bento scratching. Bento. (laughs) (laughs) All right, right, so so the next thing, I finalized my outfit. 
that I'm yes. going to wear for the wedding. Finally, he he got clothes. Yeah, he bought clothes. So. <laughs> he just had a vest. Yeah. Like, originally. That's all he had. A but vest. now I have the shirt and the pants mm-hmm. to go with it. So I'm really excited about that. I love what I'm wearing. I love yeah. it, too. I'm very, very happy with what you got. Mm-hmm. And we got the pants from a website we've never ordered from before, so we were very, very scared. Mm-hmm. But they turned out great. Yeah. And they were they were super sweet and like I, I messaged them I was like hey I just have a question what if the size doesn't fit and the lady because I was like you know these are for my wedding and everything and the lady was like oh first of all congratulations I'm super excited for you and then she goes oh yeah you can return them and, mm-hmm. know, but they fine. fit yeah yeah they they fit fine and I love it so I love the awesome. style so I'm excited did you get your shirt in not yet it's one of those that's gonna take a couple weeks so I thought you got I it from Amazon I did but it's one of those non Prime. Tell me you did not order it from Wish. No, I didn't order he it would. from Wish. He would, though. He would order his wedding shirt from Wish. I didn't. No, it was if just I find out of... that you did, I'm going to throw cake at you. As long as it got here on time, <laughs> what's the deal? I'm just going to get cake and just... <laughs> no, you wouldn't, because you wouldn't waste cake. <laughs> He's not wrong. <laughs> the next thing that we're trying to do is decide on a DJ. Yeah, so I actually need to text that person. Mm-hmm. Um, we decided instead of handling the music ourselves like we mm-hmm. originally thought, uh, we really want this to be a party. We really want people to have a fun time. Mm-hmm. We're not providing any alcohol, so we're really going to have to step up the fun time game for some people, I'm sure. Mm-hmm. And we decided that we're going to go ahead and book a DJ. Mm -hmm. Um, We also just have some friends that are in the DJ business. And so giving friends business is always good. Or giving friends of friends business is Mm -hmm. always good. And we have a little bit of extra in the budget. So I was like, all right. Because the food did not end up costing us what we thought it would. Mm -hmm. So I was like, all right, we have a little bit extra in the budget. Let's splurge on the DJ. I Mm -hmm. think that's worth it. Yeah. Um. Things we've splurged on. We decided to get a videographer. Mm -hmm. We decided not to do photography because the videography was so expensive. Mm -hmm. What we saved on the food is not nearly enough to cover a photographer. So that's why that wasn't what we chose to reallocate that money for. Mm -hmm. Um, So video is fine. We can get still still images from the video. And maybe we'll encourage people to take cell phone photos throughout mm-hmm. the night. I don't care if it's an unplugged ceremony. That doesn't bother me. Please mm-hmm. take cell phone photos and post them everywhere. I'm going to look good. <laughs> <laughs> and besides, the wedding's a show. So, like, people take cell phone photos of our show all the time. Mm-hmm. So, eh, it's fine. But I'm excited to work with the videographer. I don't know if they're ready for what we have in store for them. I think mm-hmm. they're expecting an actual wedding. <laughs> they're going to be like, here we go. Here's another boring, what is this? They're going to be entertained. Like, <laughs> yeah. I don't even know if they're going to, they might mess up. Because they might just be, like, enthralled by the show. I say this as if we're, like, that good. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> um, so we decided on a DJ. Mm-hmm. Uh, I originally wanted one of my friends to do it. But the cost of flying him in and, and putting him up is just too much, mm-hmm. um, unfortunately. Mm-hmm. And it's a week before a big convention that I know he's doing. So that's, that just right there is just no. That's mm-hmm. a big no. Yeah. But that's okay. We really, really wanted to have him, but mm-hmm. didn't work out that way. Um, let's see. What else? Oh, I had to increase the uh, bridal party. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so we have, uh, we have this one dancer that we've been um, – hoping would join us by the end of this year. Mm -hmm. Uh, I didn't know when she would be joining us. I just knew that sometime in 2022 she would be joining us. I Mm -hmm. I wasn't sure if it was going to be at the end of summer or if it was going to be like right at May or June or whatever. And turns out it's now. Uh So I was like, I can't have somebody as a member of the company practicing these shows with us and then just kick them out of the show because they're not in the bridal party. That's Mm -hmm. rude. And also, I just adore her. So yeah, she's, she's now in the bridal party. So she's one of our good friends, so it's really nice to have yeah, her. Yeah, she went from student to friend really easily. Like, she and I just, we just click. Mm-hmm. And now she's a member of the company, and she's so excited. And I'm really, really happy to have her in the bridal party. And it's not just out of necessity. Like, I absolutely love this girl. So, Mm -hmm. But it's basically both companies and your brothers and one of your best friends Mm -hmm. are the bridal party. And that's fine. Um, My brother, in case anyone's wondering, my brother's not part of the bridal party. Not because I didn't want him to be. But A, I don't think he's up for performing. And he's actually playing a completely different role in the wedding by walking me down the aisle so mm-hmm. there's really that sweet of him. it's super super sweet my mom's sort of walking me down down the aisle too mm-hmm. sort of 
So have have we figured out the timeline yet? Yes. Okay, that was another thing. I had no idea what to do about this wedding timeline. Uh-huh. Okay, we're getting married on a Saturday, so you can go as late as you want to, but I'm a, not a late night person, and my mom certainly is not a late night person. I don't know about your parents. A lot, but... of, a lot of our family is not late night people. So. Yeah, so I was like, I don't want this to end at 11. My wedding ended at 11 on a Sunday, and people left early, and it feels terrible to watch people leave your wedding early. So I was like, all right, I know it's on a Saturday, but let's, let's play this smart. Mm-hmm. So we're starting the whole thing at 2. The ceremony is in a show. It's it's a show, so it's more like you're here to see a theater production, mm-hmm. and then there's a party after. So the ceremony's a little long because it's a show. Mm-hmm. Um, so that's probably going to be about an hour and a half. There's, there's going to be an intermission. Don't worry. You can pee. It's I fine. love the idea for the intermission. <laughs> yeah, my brother was like, you're going to need an intermission so people can pee. And I'm like, oh, I didn't even think about that. Mm-hmm. So it's going to be about an hour and a half for that. And then straight from there, we go to the reception, and that's going to basically go till about 9. And all of my friends that are, like, around my age are like, yes, 9? <laughs> I love that. Even people not around my age that just want to go home, like, yeah. I love 9. So we still get all the fun stuff. Everything great about a wedding. We're going to eat around like five or six probably. So like the food that we're getting being casual is so perfect. Mm -hmm. Um, Yeah. And then if people want to go out after, they can because we're not having alcohol at the wedding. So if people really wanted to like go out and drink, go. (laughs) We're ending at nine. (laughs) (laughs) Just have fun, you know. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty cool. And I I was, we were talking about that the other day because I kept going, we need a wedding plan. Three Mm -hmm. days later. Hey, we need a wedding plan couple days later, hey, we still need a wedding plan. So then we finally, like, sit down and actually discuss this. We plan some wedding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it's usually just one thing. Mm-hmm. Speaking of not being good at wedding planning. Oh. I have a list of things we still need to do. Oh. So we're four months out, and I still have not got my dress altered. Ooh. I need to do that. Okay. I know. Um, I really need to do that. So I will when we get back from tour. Yeah. At some point. At this point, I'm about to just get Elise to come and, and clip it. Yeah. <laughs> just clip it. I don't I don't want to mess with just clip it. <laughs> I did just order you. shoes, though, and so that'll tell me how much I need to hem it. Mm-hmm. So. She'd do it for you. Oh, yeah. She absolutely would. Hey, Elise, um, you want to come to my wedding uh, and just clip me? <laughs> and then <laughs> just, hang out. Yeah, just hang out. Just, there's pizza. Just. <laughs> there's pizza and cake, guys. Um, uh, we Okay, I said actually order the cake. We need to do that. We need to send out invitations. <laughs> like yeah. now. Mm-hmm. Like actually now. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, we can do that. <laughs> um, so we're doing the invitations for the ceremony are separate from the invitations from the reception mm-hmm. because we can invite a different number of people to mm-hmm. both. So the invitations for the ceremony are going to be concert, not concert tickets, theater tickets. They're going to be like designed like you have a ticket to go see a theater show. Mm-hmm. How cool is that? That's really cool. So, like, we're basically going to be sending people tickets to our show. Mm -hmm. And then the reception will be an additional, like, card that basically says you're invited to the reception. And it's not because we, like, don't want certain people there. It's just the theater is much bigger than the event space. So, Mm -hmm. like, the ceremony, the show we're inviting people to, they basically get, like, a free show that day. Um, not everybody can come to the reception. That's just close friends and family only. Mm -hmm. But, like, lots of people can come to the ceremony. Mm Mm-hmm. And usually if you invite people to the ceremony but not the reception, it is considered rude. However, mm-hmm. um, it's different because it's a show. So yeah. we're basically saying, we're inviting you to the show. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, not everybody can come to the reception. Yeah. And then the other thing that we have to do is rehearsals. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got to get started on that. Yeah. I got to write the script. Like, mm-hmm. I haven't even written the script yet. Yeah, but so you and I fun. both know one day you'll sit there and go, I need to write the script. And, and then all of a sudden in, you're in just going to crank it out. Yeah, that's just... how I do it. I just basically crank out scripts in an hour. And then mm-hmm. I'm like, yeah, this is funny. And then I make him read it. And then I go, isn't it funny? And he goes, eh. Just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. Well, anyway, that is our mm-hmm. wedding updates. Mm-hmm. I hope that um, you're still on board with this excellent adventure of ours. And uh, I'm just so excited to marry you. I'm not real excited for all of the planning that we still have to do you're excited to marry me not if you keep doing that (laughs) (laughs) no i I really am excited to marry you i'd marry you yesterday if i could so we were busy we couldn't yesterday so 
Yeah. So I guess we'll wait till July. The boys uh, are over there fighting to the death. Yeah. T'challa, T'Challa and Bento. T'Challa just looked at Bento and was like, wham, on the head. <laughs> But anyway, thanks yeah. for joining us for this update. We uh, are probably going to update you in a couple weeks again, so stay tuned. And if you continue to want to know what's going on with our wedding, make sure you hit that subscribe button. That way you can be notified whenever we uh, put out updates and other challenges and fun things that we put on this channel. <laughs> and if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up. That way we know you like us. Please like us. <laughs> no. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. I'm Sean. And I'm Jen. And we're out of here. Bye. Bye.